I'm Sonia and I live in Medway, Kent. Um, I live with my son who has a, a disability. Um, the problems I had with my windows before I contacted H2B was that um, they were misting up inside and I was getting a lot of mould. Um, and I also ended up having sort of bronchitis um, for quite a long period of time um, and having to constantly spray with a mould cleaner to get rid of the mould and it was just getting more and more and more, I had to do it more and more often um, and I had to move all the furniture away from the windows. I couldn't afford to get them changed so I had to keep doing that, I had to throw away my curtains and then when I got quotes for the windows because it was so big it was just really, really expensive, and I just, when they gave me the quotes, I was just like, oh, thank you very much, I can't actually afford to, to to get them done. So I just had to resolve to um, having to just keep mould spraying. Well, I was looking for ways to um, find, uh, like, a grant. So I heard that sometimes people could get grants for, like, boilers and grants for windows, but I heard that they'd done away with them um, and in the past I wasn't able to get it because um, I was self-employed and owned my own home um, but I came across this one that said I might actually be able to get it I put my name in it was in the middle of the night actually <laughs> in the middle of the night I was looking for looking on the internet I was like this can't be real that I actually I might fit the criteria so I put my name into this the form online and I thought I looked at it and I thought this this is, this doesn't look right this can't be right I just put my name in and sort of forgot about it um, and that's that's how that's how I came across it and I was like oh, this 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 can't be real very very skeptical I was very skeptical about it I was I was hopeful because I needed it I, well, I couldn't lose hope because I'm that kind of person and then I started looking around for reviews <laughs> of people who maybe might have used it before and I came across two different kind of views of people that were saying yes it's real and there was other people that were going nah don't trust it it's not real and then I then I got a call saying um, just checking that, that I fit the criteria and I said, yeah, yes, yeah, I, I'm real. <laughs> you know, I'm a real person. But, you know, what I put in there is real. And um, they said, OK, we'll, 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 we're we're going to consider you. And they explained to me that um, there's only a small pot of money that, that is available for grants and they have to decide who gets it and so on. And I was like, really? <laughs> I was just kind of still a bit sceptical, like, is this real? And then I just waited. And then they got back to me and said, "Yeah, you, you, you've um, we've decided that we're we're going to help you." And I was like, "Really?" I said, "That's fantastic." I called my older daughter and I said, "I think I'm going to get my windows put in." This never happens. Not not to people like me. They never give anything to people like me. It was really friendly people. Just straightforward, friendly people at the other end that explained it again. They said that there's a small pot of money that they put aside for people that are in need, like yourself, with children that's got a disability, single parent. They said, that's why we, why we keep getting these windows for you. I was like, OK. And they said, we really, we are going to pay for it. They kind of reassured me again. And very quickly, well, I think it was within about a week, as they contacted me, um, they arranged for the window company. So I googled the window company to see if it was a bona fide window company and it was one that had been established for years um, and had really good reviews. The guy that came in to do the work, it was really good, he was really professional, was just friendly and made me feel comfortable but also um, I was really wanting to keep my architraves um, because it's an old house so to keep the architraves was really important for me and so he helped me to be able to keep that and put the windows in. Um, which a lot of the other companies said they couldn't do it, they wouldn't, they wouldn't do it. It's quieter, um, it's much quieter, it just feels more peaceful, it just encourages me to sit in here, it's warmer, um, I don't feel that draught running up my back every time I sat in the, in the living room, um, you know I don't have the, the damp problem and the mould problem which was a health issue for me um, as well so it's, it's just all round, just 
you know, I'm just so grateful for, for this. If somebody was going online and they saw H2B, I would say don't be sceptical. If you think you fit the criteria, apply. It's up to them whether they choose you or not, but they are genuine. They genuinely put aside a pot of money for people that are genuinely in need. Um, I can vouch for that. Um, and it, it definitely happened. Because I know that a small percentage of that money that they use to buy their windows will go towards helping people that are in need. And I think that's a really good um, reason to go and use H2B. I'd say, I don't know if you know, but you've done a good deed. You know, you might not know that you've done a good deed, but every time you look at your windows, you need to look at your windows and think that, you know, that those windows that are keeping you warm and keeping the noise out, you know, have also contributed to helping somebody out there that ordinarily wouldn't have got any help from anywhere, you know, to keep themselves warm. But also, I mean, in some cases, it's actually stopping them from getting ill because, you know, windows that are not sealed and everything can cause mould and damp and that can make people ill. So your, your windows are actually contributing to helping people. Thank you, H2B. You know, you're doing a really good job. I don't know who thought about this, but it's, it, it was a really good idea and much needed. And you, ju you just tapped into a really, a small little group of people that haven't had, didn't have a voice. And um, thank you. Give it a go. You know, don't, don't be sceptical. It, it's real.